right, all right, okay, all right, okay, all right, okay. What's up, buddies? Welcome back to another episode of the No Fever Point Poor Man Road to Glory. We are decked out in Christmas cheer, although, to be honest, I don't know if you guys can actually see it. Yeah, well, we're late either way, but... Wow, I look like an absolute moron. Hi! <laughs> uh, this is a weird intro. I don't know why we're still looking at this. We should probably be looking at this. It's Friday. We are a few minutes away from butt freeze, icon swaps, and so much content, my nuts are going to fall off. Seriously. In the last 12 hours, since we basically were enjoying last episode, EA have dropped four new League SBCs. We have gone into brain meltdown overdrive in terms of grinding. Bronze packs, hundreds more silver upgrade packs, uh, uh, you know, maybe not hundreds more, but way, 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 way more uh, gold three-player upgrades. We've already were completed the Sud League, the Lib, the Serie A, all done again and already probably able to do it again. Uh, we're going to work on the MLS. We did the Saudi League. Uh, as mentioned, we're going to do the leagues again. It's just, there's so much going on right now that I'm actually really having a tough time just keeping up with things. But... I'm really excited for it. So let's walk you guys through where we stand today. We're 5-1 we're and one in Weekend League. The squad is kind of doing all right. It's the tail end of the team of the group stage as well, of course. But uh, yeah, the team's doing okay in 3-5-2. Gameplay's a bit rough, so I'm happy we got our five wins out of the way and just done and dealt with, uh, if you will. So that's solid, and I'm, uh, I'm very good with that. We can now focus on all of the craziness that EA bring us in three minutes or three and a half minutes. Icon swaps will get started on. Uh, as mentioned, all of the like menu grinding we're going to keep doing. We've got so many packs open here. Now, what I'd like to do is... Uh, uh, oh, also, I started to do NEPS type of uh, unassigned thing where you can now do go fully unassigned on players if you want to and still be able to open packs and do everything. You just do it via the web app. Uh, NEPS, I think it's how to go unassigned while continuing to open packs. It's NEPS RTG episode number 70. Or, or 57 or something like that. If I can remember to get the link, I'll put the link in there for you guys. And so what I've done is I've gone pretty heavily, uh, on, well, heavily, 167, but 167 players that we got for 400 non-rare gold center backs that we got for like 400 to 700 coins. Uh, I stuck to a couple of leagues, the main leagues being the ones, just in case we get something, as you could see via that picture I showed you guys, because we're getting daily SBCs, puzzle SBCs again. I just want to be ready in case it happens. And what's the problem in basically putting money into discard center backs, right? I feel like it's kind of a, uh, a, a, a no-brainer, if you will, right? Some of the higher rated ones, of course, um, we spent a little bit more on. But I, I, I just felt like it was a good move kind of doing this times the 167 items. And again, if they don't go up that much in price... Then they don't go up that much in price. It's not uh, it's not a big deal. So as mentioned, we have gone pretty heavily on the BPM over the last 12 hours as well. Restocking the club, which has been going very, very good. Uh, annoyingly, as you guys will remember as well, a couple of days ago, we rinsed the entirety of the MLS. And it was on stream. I don't believe it was for YouTube. But I had mentioned, imagine they release the MLS SBC and I've just gotten rid of like 100 silvers and about 200 or 150 bronzes. And then, of course, we got rid of the golds as well into the gold uh, two-player upgrades and, and all of that stuff, right? Or the, the rare player picks and so on and so forth. But within the 10 hours or 12 hours of it, actually almost 24 hours 20 hours whatever it is of them releasing the league sbcs i want to see how close we are to doing the mls because we went from basically zero mls players to grinding bronze packs silver upgrade packs and then doing all the other sbcs we've probably opened already today about 50 60 70 100 silver packs from the bronze upgrades so the two silver player packs and then all of the silver packs from the saudi league so i'm going to try youtube to not show you guys that if that makes sense so on a daily basis you'll still see packs but I'm going to try and show you guys, like, open these types of packs, right? The Electrum packs, where we still have a small chance of getting something. Having you guys sit there and just watching me open an infinite number of silver packs, I'm just going to save that for my, my Twitch audience. They can end up watching me do that. They don't seem to mind watching me spam bronze packs and all of that. So, I think that's fully updating you guys. We're ready to roll in terms of, we're, we're, we're good for Elite 3 for squad battles. Division Rivals, again, we're well on our way to um, to rank one. 5-1 uh, in champs. 
we're fully caught up in objectives, and it's now officially, oh my god, center back Casemiro. It's officially foot freeze. Now, is it going to be as good as Madden? Wait, where was it? Where did it go? R3, did they put it in a team? No, it's taking us to the damn store. No, ew. Hold on. We'll have to go look at EA's tweet then, boys. Before we get into things, okay? One sec, one sec, one sec. Where's their tweet? Dude, they haven't even tweeted! They haven't even tweeted. Oh my god, EA. Oh, the spoilers! Okay, let's go look at objectives first. See what they put in objectives for icon swaps. Here we go. Bud Freeze Yannick Bolassi is pretty dope, dude. Okay, so score two goals uh, per match in three separate matches using Premier League players. So we're going to have to build a Premier League setup, boys. Look at that. We get to use a Premier League setup, dudes, and managerial uh, assist 10. Score two or more goals in three matches. K. Okay. Score in, in 15 separate matches. Holy God. So you're going to have to play uh, 15 games while scoring with Prem players. Okay. Score four outside the box goals using Prem players and win seven matches. I love it. I love it. So we'll work on him probably on Monday though. Icon swaps. Here we go, boys. So friendlies. One league. Oh my God. They made a new friendly, boys. Look at this. Win six matches in live foot friendlies. One league with at least five first owner Prem players. This is so amazing. Oh, so many W's. Have they done it all in? Yes. Are you serious? Serie A team, Premier League team, and it's only five first owners. So you can, oh, this is such a W, dude. I'm in my, I'm a freaking dad and I'm excited. I'm just excited off my tits right now. Win six matches. Oh, this is so great, dude. This is the best W ever. The only thing I'm worried about right now because this almost feels too good to be true is they put a goddamn limit, a win limit, or a game limit in the section. But I don't think they can, considering you need so many wins. Okay, so hopefully there isn't a game limit. Uh, so first owner, score 10 separate matches. Okay, well, I mean, obviously that's going to happen pretty quickly. Score in 20 separate matches. And score. So no matter what, you're going to need 30. But 6, 12, 18, 24, 30. Bros, oh my god, this is such a huge win, man. This is such a huge win. I got swaps too. <coughs> Hold on. Oh, it's squad battles. Oh my god, on world class. With 11 Eredivisie players. 11 MLS players. Well, good thing. With each one of these. Guess what the theme was here. And you should have been able to predict this too. Shame on me for not stocking up on uh, the good players. But either way... World class isn't really that hard. I got to be completely honest. We're going to do this next week, okay, boys? For me, we're already Elite 3 in Squad Battle. So we're going to start this on Monday next week. In the evenings, I'll do it on my own time. Uh, and we'll get this all done next week. Yeah? Boom. Beautiful. Okay, Beckham's best. That is still impossible to do, but we'll work on it. Milestones, anything added? No. Oh, this is so good, EA Sports. They have done so great. And thank God we got our wins. We're just going to grind uh, <clears throat> icon swaps. So let's jump over here. What do we got now? Here it is. A Fut Freeze Marquinhos is sick, dude. Okay. I kind of like that. I'm a big fan of position changes, man. I'm a really, 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 really big fan. Paris, 86 rated. Okay. It is what it is. <clears throat> Where are the swaps? <coughs> is it here oh my lord two times ultimate packs two ultimate packs for two oh this is wow they've gone so heavily oh it's Vidic. one of them's Vidic. oh god there's too much content wait hold on a second so they've they've allowed you to not even go the route of 62 days remaining is pretty dead though but anyways yeah, imagine that was repeatable. I think everybody would do this for Team of the Year. But anyways, so two swaps for two ultimate packs is a W. I like that because a lot of the times you're left with a couple of swaps. And last year you are able to get like a rare Electrum or whatever, right? Pack or whatever the dead pack was. So that's kind of cool. 85 times 5 pack. For three swaps. 
Would it not be better to do this? Okay. 83 plus times 25 pack? Five eighty-five pluses is insane. Dare I say I wouldn't mind doing all of these instead. I might take the packs too, boys. To craft other Icon SBCs as they come, that could be huge. Huh. Okay, okay, okay. That's a thought process there. Something we're going to have to discuss a little bit further for the, uh, for the PMRTG. Okay. Now, let's see. What are we looking at here? So, Vidic, we did say we needed a defender. Another Man United player, though. I used his mid card. I didn't use his baby. I don't know if his baby is going to be nuts or not. Okay. Okay. Oh, so we did get a base icon pack for eight tokens. Oh, my God. Wait, what the hell is that? Base or mid icon pack? Oh my god, Haji kind of dead in my opinion. So Davor Suker was an actual leak then. I think I would do this one. Okay, Davor Suker. Oh, a mid icon pack. Ronald Coleman. Oh lord, it's his prime. Ooh, Frank Reichardt as well. If you start him out in the midfield and then actually use him as a center back is kind of huge. He's high medium, isn't he, though? Or high low or something? Dead? Yeah, I don't know about that. But in a three-man midfield, if we are still running three at the back, that could still be pretty great. Mid or prime? Hold on. 15 tokens for a mid or prime, right? 12 for that. You could do... I think you could do a base and a base or mid, couldn't you? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. There's another page, isn't there? What the hell? Base icon player pick pack Thierry Henry! Okay, I'll be completely honest with you guys. I think they've done this on purpose. I think they've made the icons that you can get guaranteed to be kind of trash. So pretty much everybody is going to be focused because we're all degenerate gamblers. We're all going to be focused on doing icon packs where we, you know, you spend a month of grinding and you get an Inzaghi and stuff. I think that's what they've done. They've made the icon packs even more enticing. Uh, I don't, yeah, I don't know if I really want a base unless there's a Croy for a Eusebio in there. For 17 tokens, that's kind of insane. Dude, this one is nuts. Visions of grandeur here, boys. With a 90 hullet. Visions of grandeur here. I think we might be pushing this one. I think, that, I think we might be pushing this one. So, is there going to be 17 tokens then? Did, they, did, did it say somewhere? Oh, wait, no. I guess it would, that the first set of unlockables, I mean, we won't even be able to open that for a while, right? Because of objectives. If you go over to the objectives. One, two, three, four, five, five. So there's eight. Just eight. Only 11? No, no, no. That's not accurate. There's only eight. These aren't, these aren't icon swaps. These are, so there's only eight right now, right? Eight, then there's ten next. Only eleven right now? Are you guys okay? Are we are we able to do math or no? So there's eighteen total, yeah? Oh my god, I haven't even looked at the team yet! Oh god! Okay, hold on. Focus up. So what, what, this is the, you know, a fun discussion to have. What route are we going? I like these two as well, dude. I kind of like the idea of going with these two and... Can you do that? And that. I might do the base or mid icon because, I mean, if your luck is in, your luck is in, right? 
And then we get an 83 plus 25 pack and an, an 85 plus times 5 pack? That's tempting, man. There are 11 swaps? No, there are not. Unless I'm missing some. Are they available via SBCs? So what do you guys think? I'm, I'm tempted by that. The thing is, is I don't know if I want to use my swaps immediately because you might end up changing your mind, right? Three of them are offline. Guys, you guys are very brain dead. I've literally walked you through it. Eight online, three offline is 11. I... I kind of want to just ban because people are actually getting mad at me now for this. Are you guys okay? Seriously? One, two, three, four, fucking five. Take the time to actually understand and look at this that there are not three other tokens here. YouTube, I wish you could see my chat right now. It's carnage and it's carnage because people are idiots. There's eight right now. You absolute wet noodles. Says the guy wearing a Christmas hat with balls hanging off of it. <clears throat> Anyways. Okay. Uh, what about icon swaps too? There's 11, bro. Ah. <sighs> God. mods can you time out the stupidity please i just honestly i can't i can't do it i can't do it i i actually can't do it you guys have my blessing to go up and send those guys to the gulag till tomorrow the fact that people are doing it and not even like as a joke right like just genuinely constantly arguing with me about their oh god my brain okay so anyways back to what we were talking about here do you guys not think that Five times 85s, 25 times 83s plus, right? It's not 83s, it's plus. So there's gotta, surely there's gotta be two or three higher than 83. If you're, I mean, unless your luck really sucks. Dude, I'm tempted to save this for team of the year, man. Can you imagine? The ultimate packs as well. Although ultimate packs are kind of dead. So I, I would almost want to save, if we did... That's 10. We'd only have 8 more. So you could do all of that in the base icon pack, which I kind of think is dead. I'd like the chance to get a mid, too. 25 times 83 isn't going to be worth a lot, but it's not 25 times 83, right? It's 25 times 83 plus. So... As of right now, I'm thinking the base or mid icon... Because the good news is here, we can use, build our eight tokens and have this ready to go for team of the year. And then for the next season, which is, it will restart right around team of the year, maybe even after team of the year, at least you have these ready to go. And then the next season, you can go get yourself the base or mid icon. But I, I, I'd be BSing if I said this one wasn't exciting. That would leave us only with two tokens left, so you'd have to go get the two ultimates as well. No leaks either? I, dude, I love it. I'm such a big fan of all of this. This is so great. This is dead. I, I do truly believe that the icons themselves are pretty awful. And I think it was done on purpose. I mean, a Divorce Sucre is kind of dope. You can probably make an argument for Ronald Coleman or even Frank Radcard being good. You can make an argument for that Vidic. I'm sure there's a lot of Man United fans that are excited about that too. Damn, I don't know what I want to do, man. Luck is in, your luck is in, right? If your luck is in, your luck is in. Now, cure again, bit just just food for thought. 89 mid icon. What, what are we looking at here? Can I go... Does Fudbin and stuff have that as an option where we can filter through just to see what will be in packs? 
I think it, it does filter, right? Okay, so if I go over here and uh and we do that. So is it version icons for Christ dude? Um version icons middle. There we go. And then we can go minimum can I just do minimum rating? 89. Filter. Wait, 89 to 99. Hell yeah. Okay. So, dude, what is going on? Oh my god. So, from best to worst, from worst to best, 89 plus mid icon. So, David Beckham? Bro, what is, like, what, what, what is happening here? Why is it spamming me with this, dude? What is that? That's ridiculous. Okay. Well, this is the problem, right? Spending the entire uh, Icon Swaps 1, you still have the chance at Bobby Moore, Giggs, Loudrup, Shearer, Rude Van Nistelrooy, Rush, Klose, Trezeguet, Paul Scholes, Raquel May, Schmeichel, Hero, Van Basten's kind of good though, Anesta, Baresi, Leviashin, Gary Lineker. Bro, there are so many terrible icons. I don't, that, nah, I don't think I would do it. The problem is we're all degenerate gamblers, right? So when you think of 89 plus, you think here. You think from here and above, boys. You think maybe Stoikov, DDA, right? Fucking being spammed with the same damn stream. Um, Stevie G maybe even, Kaka, Balak, right? You start thinking these. This is what you're thinking. Ronaldo, Hullet, of course. Pele, Eusebio, Johan Cruyff, Zidane even. Oh my god, that Zidane would be crazy. Dino, oh my lord, Dino. That would be so nuts. Right? So, I'm glad I showed you guys this. Because of exactly what we've basically discovered. Is that it's a super attractive... And that's the... Honestly... Immediately, this was the first one I was thinking about. This is the first one I was thinking about. Right here. I was like, immediately in my head, I'm like, this is the one we have to do. For sure. But, I mean, mid or prime is kind of dope too, actually. You could do that and get the 585 plus pack. Dude, mid or prime is kind of sweet. I'm not a fan of gambling. Well, you're playing the wrong video game then, my guy. Thinking of 85 plus, 83 plus, and a base or mid icon. That's 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 what I think I'm going to do too. Again, if the luck is in, the luck is in, man. Uh, look, you could, you could go do... Honestly, what's the most expensive one? You could go do this one. The player pick and get three of the most dead babies ever. And you spent the entire 60 days or 50 days, let's say, right? Doing this. It's just if you got the luck. So what I would do is I'd almost like to play the odds better in my favor and just give myself a chance to get better things or more things. So the base or mid, the 83 times 25, I think could be a sick pack or could be the worst pack ever, of course, if your pack luck isn't in. And then 85 plus is, is kind of a W because you get five players value 12K. So you know, you're looking at like a 60K value pack just in terms of the of, of the fodder value. Three dead babies. Yeah, I mean, I guess if you take that out of context, that can sound pretty grim. But you know, you know what? I mean, obviously, <laughs> unless you're listening to this stream or this epi as a podcast, you're sitting there thinking, what the fuck did he just say? <laughs> um, damn. Hey, for me, boys, I think we're we're gonna we're gonna roll we're gonna uh, as much as we 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 talk about this game being a gambling simulator. I'm of age to gamble if I wanted to, and I don't see anything wrong with it with throwing our hat in the ring to try and get something good. And then worst case scenario, we've got a David Trezeguet. I mean, to some extent, we've got the Edwin Vandersar. We might get another. We might have three icons to just put into a bigger icon down the road, right? Because these guys are expiring pretty soon. Which, of course, will mean that we'll get an opportunity to get more icons to craft, which is great. 
And here's hoping by Team of the Year, because Team of the Year is going to be the PAX onslaught, right? Anytime we get a duplicate 85 or 86 or 87, we're going to look. During Team of the Year, dude, if we're going to be opening 1,000 plus packs, we'll probably craft most, if not all, of the icons that are available. That's just going to be the way it is, realistically. <clears throat> the biggest W is that these icon swaps are in friendlies? Yep, absolutely. 100%. Dude, I'm, I'm I'm genuinely right now really looking forward to doing the swaps. Doing one by one. Specifically because I'm really excited to build a squad. So should we go look at this damn foot freeze before we open our packs? Or what, what the hell? How do you do that? Is it in the new... Has the new... Se oh, look at that though. New section's been updated pretty sweetly. Look at that. Complete player token objectives. Earn player tokens. Redeem them. From December 11th to January 1st, eight player tokens available. Well, there's the... I wonder how many guys are still saying there's 11 player tokens. Um, the remaining 10 player tokens will be available from January 1st to February 12th. So, so there it is. So probably by like mid-January, maybe by the end of Team of the Year, we'll get that baby or mid-icon pack too. Damn, I love it. I love it so much. Wait, what's this? But freeze player SBCs. Oh, they're doing it like a look forward. Look at that. Do you see that? So they're giving us a sneak peek at what's to come. Every day, by the way, it has a new player. So it's not like this is the rest of the event's going to be these three players. I would assume that the, the next three days will have these guys. That's really cool. I like that a lot. Where's the, like, where's the actual Fut Freeze team, though? Did they put it in items? Come on, EA. Update it, dude. There we go. All right. So... Position change money at striker. So this is... Look at Terrera as a left back. Dude, how cool is this, man? Am I the only one that thinks this is really cool? I lo Look at that Cam Bernardo Silva, too. Oh, that's so awesome. Left mid Verratti with 88 pace is hilarious. Right back Golovin? CDM Sané? Rodriguez moved into the DM role. Nani as a cam, five star, five star. Wow, look at what they did with Verratti too. I, hey, can we go look on the market real quick too? I'd like to see if they've like changed work rates and stuff as well. That Nani is going to be so fun, man. You give him a hunter for MLS objectives. Oof, really, really fun card. Terrera? So like, I wonder, is Terrera, has Terrera been made a, a left-footed player? God, I love it. This is my favorite part of what they do with Fut. We've been asking for this type of stuff for years and we finally got it. Look at that Casemiro, man. Dude, do you understand how good that Casemiro is going to be? I'm telling you right now. That Casemiro will probably be in most people's favorite center back setups for a while. Oh, I love it. EA knocked it out of the park, boys. I was upset that obviously Futmus was going away, but this is, I mean, dare I say this is better. We still get daily SBCs, we get daily players, and we got a team of, of, of players changed around? Okay, let's go see. Let's go see. Has anyone packed? Um, is it in, uh, is it in here? Oh, they haven't, wait. You can't search for them yet? Oh, that's kind of idiotic. Am I blind? Are you able... No? Okay, so let's, uh, I guess we can do it like this then. Let's go over here. I really want to see what these players look like. Uh, Robertson has been a letdown, but anyways, all good. Uh, I don't really need the coin, so we'll just keep them for now. Okay, so the first one being Mane. Let's see. Oh, please, EA. Please, please have gone that extra mile in changing, like, work rates and stuff. Here we go. Okay, so... Mane's regular card is high, medium, four star, four star. Come on, EA. Come on, EA. Come on, EA. Yes! It looks like they've done it, boys. High, low. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. So the card itself obviously isn't like that much better, although his long shots are fantastic. His long shots have been upgraded nicely. Okay, so there, I'm not. It's it's not the money that is making me excited. It's the other players. So, for example, Casemiro. This is what I'm talking about here. So Casemiro. I mean, already that's such a great change. Look at his pace, dude. Up by 13. 
Defending up by four. All right. So what do we got here? His defensive stats are 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 good, but obviously for a center back, you're hoping maybe they did medium high. Come on, EA. Come on, EA. They've done it, boys. Here we go. This could be a good year for content. This could be a good year for content. Low high work rates. This guy will be one of. I'm promising you right now, one of the most overpowered center backs in the game. Holy God. What an awesome little upgrade that is. I don't know what team player and solid player means. Stupid traits, but. So if you give him a, uh, a shadow, 93 sprint speed, 82 acceleration is insane. All 99s for defending too. Great stamina. Great reactions, great composure, great passing. His long shots are semi-decent. I love it. I know you guys might think maybe I'm overreacting. I love the... Dudes, you guys know, man. Fut Birthday and Shapeshifters was one of my favorite events last year. Because we finally started seeing stuff like this. Oof. I love that. Okay. Um, His balance isn't good. He's a center back. He'll be fine. He'll be perfectly fine. Uh, okay, who's up next? Bernardo, right? Let's see. I mean, now I'm excited to check out Bernardo because I think he was high high as well on his regular card, wasn't he? Dude, oh my god. Look at the boosts on this card. It's gonna be like high low or high medium. I can't wait to see this. <sighs> Winners, man. EA, EA have really, really done well here. I'm a bit... And they made him four star, four star! Oh, sweet lord, dude. That is so awesome. High, medium, and four star, four star. Dude, so great. Look at the shooting. Look at the long shots boost. Look at the finishing boost and the attack positioning. Holy moly. Look at the passing boost. 87 long passing. W. W. I'll fight you if you disagree. I don't even care. Oh my god. Yeah. Japes is going to be so excited about that Bernardo Silva, man. Uh, Ronaldo, De Bruyne, and Sanchez all linked. Yeah, I don't know how I would fit him, though. It's just too many good players to use at this point. This is a huge W. What a great event so far. Too bad the gameplay and the servers are ass. All right, now we got that out of the way. Yes, I understand. Gameplay sucks my nuts. I get it. I, I agree. Okay, who's up next now? Is Terrera next? No, no, who's who's next down the list? I did see a Hazard. Who was the next one? Was Ver Oh, Verratti. Oh my god, dude. This is really cool. Just on a quick glance, I saw huge changes to his car. Dude, come on, man. You can't say that this isn't awesome. Especially because Verratti is super short. This might be the first time ever... Zwei will actually be able to use a Verratti. Remember last year, Zwei tried to, like, sell us this idea that, that Verratti was good in-game? And he literally lost, like, eight games in a row trying to use Verratti? Um, this might be the first year he's actually usable. Bro, 24 pace boost. 24 shooting boost. They took off his defending, of course. Physical dribbling is great. So let's have a look. Let's have a look. So medium, high, four-star, four-star. He's going to be actually sick. High, medium? I would assume high high maybe dude nah this is sick this is actually sick this is what i wanted Th this is dudes the years of moaning about cards like this being useless or people being a fan of verati but not being able to use them this is such a w it's nuts to me it is such a w man defending nerf dot 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 yeah because he's meant to be an attacker now my guy dot 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 and there there's a representation of the fifa community never being happy about anything and we move forward um imagine him with neymar like as a central cam oh i love it okay let's see what we're looking at here so from 61 sprint speed to 83 from 68 acceleration and 94 man 60 finishing to 85 56 shot power to 80 58 long shots oh my god 71 attack positioning to 95. I mean, his passing is good already. Again, his, his dribbling is nuts already. I love it. I love it. He's got flair as well. D dude, this card will be really fun to use, man. Seriously. 
This is massive. This is... Did they... Wait, 95 composure? I didn't see that. I mean, well, he's got 94 composure already, so... Dude, it's so great. Boys, I really hope you guys can see. I understand gameplay is ass, but... If you try and have fun within friendlies, these are the types of cards that you could still fit into those teams, man. He's like a PSG Insigne. Oh my lord, I love this so much, man. I am such a fan of this. Again, he's probably going to be high, low, or high, medium. Uh, you, yeah, you've knocked it. You've knocked it out of the park. I, 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 you've knocked it out of the park. This is fantastic. What a player to have in a Bundesliga setup, man. I hope Zwei uses this guy this weekend. Look at that Hazard, man. Are you serious? Oh, my lord. Central cam, wide left cam. Left wing, in-game, make a switch around, you know? Better than his brother, too. Yeah, crazy. What a card. I love it. So the pace gets a nice little bump up, but specifically, look at that shooting boost, man. Passing stays about the same. Dribbling stays about the same, which is already fantastic. He gets plus 5 stamina and plus 10 strength. Seriously. There's no way people think this is this sucks, right? There's no way people think this sucks. Okay, yeah, gameplay, as we've said 3,000 times, sucks that you gotta take it into dead gameplay. But friendlies is kind of the, the kryptonite of dead gameplay. Because you can still have a lot of fun is it two r's here we go i'm really excited to see what they've done with him oh such a win such a win dude such a win this is fucking incredible man he might actually beat out ferlin mendy now for people so medium high three star three star they did make him left-footed on the left side. What a sick thing. So, work rates and weak foot skill moves. I, I don't. I still think Ferlin Mendy will be better. But, I'm not kidding, man. Using this guy in a three-back center-back setup. Starting him out at left-back. And then bringing him in as, like, your left CB. I love it. I love it so much. Medium-high. Left-footed. So from 76 acceleration to 89, dude. From 72 sprint speed to 85. His shooting drops off a bit, but again, he's your left back, so it's not that deep. His passing improves a little bit. Actually, his crossing goes up. Wow. wow. Have you noticed that per position, contrary to other years, they've actually updated the stuff hugely that makes sense? So again, as a DM, you're not too concerned about his crossing, right? 71. As a left back, they boosted his crossing to where it makes sense. Do you understand how many times I've sat here and made fun of EA for releasing players as a left back, but then their crossing is like 12? Or they've made a player a center back, but their fucking defensive stats are 60? They finally figured it out, man. Finally. It's, it's, it's fantastic. I feel like I'm in Bizarro World right now, dude, where EA have actually done the right things. It's taken them 12 fucking years to do it right, but they've done it. They, they, they've seriously done it so well. Look at that. The strength, the stamina, the aggression. The dribbling is going up too, of course. I love it. I love it. I'm a hu I'm such a huge fan of this. I am such a huge fan of this. Yeah, let's look at Lotaro too. I'd be interested to see because Lotaro had high, high work rates, right? So have they turned Lotaro immediately into an actual user usable Serie A wide player? Oh, they, you know they have. Oh, you absolutely know they have. All right, let's go look at the um, the base one, okay? So high medium. Oh, he's high medium. Okay, four star, four star, two. High, low, and left footed. Nah, suck your mom, dude. This is so great. This is so great. They just turned him into Leo Messi for the Serie A, man. I know we've all said we want to see Cristiano and Messi play together, but now you can do it super easy. High, low, four star, four star, left footed. Who needs Dybala anymore? I'm so hyped about this, dude. I'm sorry for sounding like an idiot, but 84 acceleration to 92, 83 to 91 for sprint speed. 
shooting, you know, it's kind of the same-ish, which is okay. I'm not totally against that. Which would then mean that, yeah, shooting is a bit better on his uh, inform, which is okay as a striker. Again, I don't disagree. Again, look at the crossing switch. Look at it. From 56 to 82. Curve from 78 to 85. W's. W's everywhere, EA. You guys have done great, boys. I know you hate my guts and you think I hate you too, but this is, this is, this is huge. Whatever devs decided to push this out like this, they've knocked it out of the park, man. Seriously. Massive win. I adore this so much. Beautiful. Okay. Cool. W's everywhere. Hey, de who, who else? Who else? Who else? There's quite a few more, right? What, what, what are we going next? Where are we going next? Gullivan's the final one. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, not Gullivan. Who, 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 who? Marquinhos and Balassi are... are uh, we can check them on their own. That's no problem. Nani, thank you. Nani is Nani is one of them. I love it. I love it. I, I know I've not said anything intelligent in about 15 minutes, but I love it, dude. Five star, five star, high medium. Okay, so they haven't changed. I mean, his stats are already nuts as it is. I was kind of hoping for high low, but that's okay. That's all right. It is what it is. High medium is still fantastic, right? Look at that. 78 acceleration to 89. 67 sprint speed to 76. So not huge. Would have been would have been nice maybe if they bopped that up to like 80 or 81 or 82 for sprint speed. But whatever. Beggars can be choosers. Finishing. So the long shots and shot power go up. Finishing goes up. Kind of a nice nice boost. Passing is up. And this basically looks like they've made him an inform position change. Realistically. I don't see much difference. Player and outside of the foot shot trade. Dude, this guy, he'll be really fun to use, man. I, 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 I suspect he'll be really, really fun to use. Definitely. That's massive. Uh, oh, yeah, Sane. Yeah, yeah. For some reason, I thought you guys meant Leroy Sane. Yeah, yeah, Sane. The DM, right? Is it Salif Sane? Is it? Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's see. Medium high 6-5. Two star, three star. Three star, three star, medium high. Okay. Right. So now it's going to be interesting whether or not they worked on that balance and agility because he's gone from a center back to a DM. From 35 balance to 75 balance. And yet they can't make Ibra have better balance, which I find hilarious. But anyways, 54 agility to 77. This is just W's everywhere. Do you understand how cracked this card's going to be with a shadow? as a dm or you move them to center back in game do you guys understand how nuts this card will be do you guys are you guys understanding in terms of uh, this this insanity this is crazy this is the ea are just getting w's everywhere man i can't even look at the shot power and long shots and the passing he's gone from a dead center back to a legitimate, like, top 10 DM. I, I, I dude, I, I, I can't even, like, begin to say. Do we miss anything else? Marquinhos and whatever. Anyone from the packable ones? Velasquez and Marquinhos, I am aware of. Did I miss anybody else from packable? Oh, Rodriguez. Has, oh, man. I'm actually really excited to check this Rodriguez. Yeah, yeah. It's Eredivisie, which is a little bit dead. Wait, where is he? He's like a 70-something, right? Is it Jonathan Rodriguez? No, it's not. Damn it. Who was it again? What's his first name? Ricardo. It's definitely Ricardo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, got it. So cool, dude. I love it. Sorry, did I say Eredivisie? Whatever, man. Pretty sure he was in the Eredivisie, but anyways. So, medium, medium, left-footed, three-star, three-star. 
medium high. Okay, still three star, three star. But what a cool, like, in a 3-5-2 as a left DM, that's pretty sweet. I like that. Okay, so 68-2, 72. Okay, so his pace hasn't gone up much. They've boosted his shot power and long shots by a little, but he's meant to be a holding DM. So, of course, you'd hope the passing strength and defense goes up, which it does. So cool, dude. So cool. It just gives you so many different options, man. And the Serie has been begging for, like, a good DM. So that's that's really great. He's Serie Nick? Thanks, man. Thank you. He's the one you don't want, I guess? I disagree. I think he's still fun. I mean, if you mean you mean from a pack? Okay. Oh, and Gullivan. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Gullivan was, what, high medium or high high, right? Yeah, I forgot about Gullivan. Dude, so great. Look at that, man. High medium, four star, four star. So the fact that he's four star, four star is really cool for a right back position. Now that I mean, the one downside, of course, is Liga uh, has so many good right backs at this point, or a few good right backs. But let's see, what are the changes? High, high, four star, four star. How about this guy is a right mid in our three five two, dudes? That's what I'm talking about. I think. How how the hell do I fit him in a team though? We're just going to have to pack an Mbappe or a Neymar, I suppose, at some point. That's great. I like that a lot. A, a right mid in 3-5-2 can be fantastic. Okay, so now let's see. So they've dropped off his shooting. So 77 acceleration to 85. 83 to 91 for sprint speed. I mean, his, sh his shots are actually not that much worse, so I'm okay with that. As a right mid, you're not going to get many shooting opportunities. So his passing didn't really improve much, which is surprising. Uh, his dribbling has gone up, but kind of stays the same. His dribbling is pretty good, especially for a right back. I I'm happy with that. And then as you can see, really, it's the physical. Look at that. 96 stamina, 71 strength, 92 aggression, 67 defensive awareness to 81, 73 interceptions to 88. Man, I have like a sore throat. I've been so excited about this. 96 stamina is mad, especially with high height. Start to finish, this guy will be high pressing all game if you want him to. This guy, well, not this guy. But um, this guy is like a Bielsa dream player. This is basically Luke Ayling on steroids for us. Leads game in an hour and a half, boys. Come on. Hope we can get something against West Ham. I really do. West Ham are a bit scary right now. They're in good form. <clears throat> we now see how dead team of the group stage was. Yeah, no, definitely. Absolutely. I agree. And, and to think people pre -epaculated. I wouldn't feel bad for you if you pre epaculated for, for Futt Freeze. This stuff is pretty sweet, man. I'm going to hold firm, but we haven't been on the rich man since we packed Red Ronaldo. We might have to go on the rich man and just bop some packs for the for the F of it. Yeah, I wouldn't blame people for pre -epaculating. Okay, uh, so Bolassi is uh, the grindable one. We'll get him at some point. Oh, I love, I love, I love it. I just love the shooting boost already, man. Huge. So high, low, five star. Come on, did they make him a four star weak foot? Please, EA. Damn it. Unlucky. Okay, that's fine though. Five star skills, high, low. Still pretty cool. Still a pretty fun card. So 77 acceleration, 83 sprint speed to 83, 89. That's massive. And look at the shooting boost, dude. 66 finishing to 81. 72 attack positioning to 89. Dude, 80 shot power to 99 shot power? 67 long shots to 83. Passing goes up nicely as well. Like, like really nicely. Vision to 80. Long passing to 76. Short passing to 84. I mean, they even gave him dope dribble. Look at the balance, man. Oh, he's uh, he might actually be cracked. 6-1 with 81 balance? Oh my. AD Composure is a nice little boost too. Stamina up to 81. That's a cool card. That's a very cool card. Very, very cool card. Okay, and then if you want me to look at Marquinhos, I mean, we can go look at him actually in the game, but... Kind of excited to see what they've done with him. So medium high, 4-4. Four, four. So no changes to his I mean, yeah, either way, it's still good for a DM, the work rates and stuff. 
would be cool if they maybe give him like a four star weak foot or something but uh, beggars can't be choosers okay so 70 acceleration 73 sprint speed 2 78 81 so not a massive jump in pace but a big enough jump where it's awesome if that makes sense like with a shadow this guy is nuts look at the shooting shot power boost i mean that's kind of a weird one i kind of like that this doesn't make any sense like they super boosted attack positioning and shot power but barely touched finishing and long shots but i don't hate it i kind of like that they did it like that it's weird look at the passing boost man vision from 68 to 80 crossing up short passing from 82 to 94 oh my lord composure up to 91 dribbling up to 74 ball control up to 90 reactions up to 92 dude this is a nuts dm this is like the league and kante boys this is a league and kante isn't it this is this is a league and kante it really is he's available as a loan oh damn yeah, I don't believe in loans. I've, I've deleted all my loans. But that's cool for those of you guys that want to test them out in friendlies and ruin people's days. <sighs> all right, so this is just from the silver spam and stuff. Um, we still haven't looked at all the SBCs. There's, dude, we're 45 minutes into the epi. I, I haven't opened packs, and we haven't even looked at all the SBCs yet. How crazy is that? So awesome, dude. I'm, I'm such a big fan. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. I'm going to store all these. We'll sell them this week or maybe Saturday or something. Got too much, uh, too much to sell. Too much to go through. Okay, so before we even go into squad battles, another thing, another thing we haven't checked is what the friendlies look like. So I haven't even confirmed if there's game limits. I feel like m my viewer base would have freaked out. So Silver Lounge, here's the one league so it's unlimited so i can oh god league uh, is gonna be hell on earth league uh, is going to be hell on earth with everybody with their loan mbappes but the, i don't hate this i really don't it basically means that you won't have to deal with icons because it, it, honestly it, it, if if there's just, there's no way so i'm assuming it has to be in the on the bench as well right Oh, they've done so great, dude. They, they've really, 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 really... See? Needs to be on the bench, too. They've done so great. So great. So let's go do... Uh, we'll rename this to... Uh, icon Swaps. Icon Swaps. Now, for me, it's going to be tough because I just discarded all my uh, loans. But I, I, I'd i rather struggle. I, I honestly would. But we got a good base of Eredivisie players, which is nice as well. Okay. So, which uh, which league should we start with here, boys? Sorry, we have so much to do. I, I apologize that uh, kind of keeping you guys waiting here. I've got all of the other Eredivisie players as well to use, which is fantastic. Dudes, I can't hate on EA for this, man. I'm such a big fan. I am such a big fan of this. I'm such a big fan of this. The servers didn't die either. Hey, that's another W2. Yeah, we didn't even talk about that. Start with Serie A. Just to get Ronaldo in there. How many people are going to quit on me with, when they see that Ronaldo, though? Probably a lot, right? Okay, let's roll with Serie A. So you need, what, six? Six first owners, which I think we shouldn't have a problem with. Five? Six? There's one. There's two. There's three. Uh, there's four. Five? Okay. We've got four right now. Hmm. Probably end up using like an Ericsson or something like that. Ribery could be fun. Oh, dude, yes! We're gonna use Pandev. We're gonna use Pandev. I forgot about Pandev. Okay, and then the other, uh, where is it? Silver? Wait, does he show up as a silver? No, I don't think he does. 
I have to search it like this. Oh, there's Fun Freeze. They did add it. Nice. Took him a few a few minutes, but this one, right? Yeah, I gotta throw him in there too. Keen, Moist Keen plays in the in League Iron Brother. Too many attackers, man. Now, <coughs> one, two, hold on. One, two, three, four, five. So, Berardi can come out. He can be maybe even be a super sub. All the objective players. Exactly, man. This is, this is, dudes, they've done great. I, it's, it's very hard for me to dislike what they've done here. Do loans count as first owner? Yep. Which is why loans are so important for everybody. But I, I want it to be difficult. I, I really do want it to be difficult for me. Was this a buy or first owner? Okay, it is first owner. I don't know if I'll use him, though. Hmm. Kind of excited to see what the experience is in-game, too. Uh, so we've got Baco. Yeah, the defensive line is a bit of a yikes, isn't it? What are we What are we going to do defensively? Jesus, 74 pace. What do, we, what do we got here? I'm assuming player prices have gone up a little bit, right? Oh, see, I wish we could have Romagnoli. We're a ways away from unlocking him. Well, I'd assume Manolas has gone up in price by a little, at least, or a lot. Maybe that guy'd be finally right about him being 150k. I don't know if we run 3-5-2. I feel like I'm going to get melted for pace. Luis Felipe is awful as well. Like, really bad. Can we just go Juan Jesus for the F of it, boys? What do you guys think? I think so. I think so. Uh, whatever, right? We lose some games. Who cares? Not that deep. I like that back line. What a cool team, man. Seriously. What a cool freaking team. Okay, and in terms of DMs, should we try out what's his name? This guy? I don't know how much he is, but it could be maybe a little bit fun. I'll just go with myself and goal, no big deal. How about that? How about that as a Serie A squad, boys? And then he, I, I have to fill it out with whatever else. <coughs> He's 20k? Is that it? Wow. Now, a little bit of BPM. We did the Serie A already, and look at that. Look at the BPM restocking us already. T to almost 10 players. Nuts. Okay, maybe three super subs will be good, too. Look at that. Just the silver packs we opened today. Look at how many silvers we've got back. Um, let's flip it around and go the other way. So Erickson maybe as a super sub, just in case Pandev is really struggling. And maybe Lukaku or Osimen in, in case uh, Correa is struggling too. So I mean, Osimen is his time is limited. He's gonna get rinsed. But I'm thinking that for our setup. For a 3-5-2 setup, buddies. I actually think that could be pretty good. I'm kind of I'm kind of down with that. And then in game Cristiano and Pandev swap. That's it. That's the only change. Oh, Silver Leao could be fun too. Yeah. Silver Leao could be fun too. Do you, do you want to try Silver Leal? Could we use Correa as a, uh, as a central? Yeah, we just packed. Ooh, hoo -hoo. And then instead of OC, we'll have Pandev. 
Or instead of Berardi, we'll have Pandev. Why not? Ah, Berardi would kind of be good. Maybe we'll do that. There we go. What do you guys think? Uh, and then in-game, Ronaldo and Correa would swap, I suppose? We'll use Correa as a cam? A bit dead, but if, if we don't do well with him, we can bring on Pandev. Pandev is a baller. Tempted to see what the what the, the heck the pricing is here. Let's see. Wait, why doesn't it not sh why can't I put Fut Freeze here? It shows in the other tab. Oh EA. So annoying, man. Guess we'll go DM then. I thought you guys said he was 30k. Flyers. Oh, is he extinct? Because he's too cheap? Wait, he's gone... Uh, oh my god, how much has he gone up in 20 minutes? Dude, the guy's gone up 20k in 20 minutes. Hold on a sec. How do I do? I, I think I have to do this on the web app, don't I? I, th I think I have to do this on the web app, right? Yeah, I got to do it on the web app because of the uh, the way we've invested. Yeah, 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 you got to do it on the web app. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. I'm not, I'm not too concerned about it. No big deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah we got to do it on the web app. Okay. Uh, in terms of... On here. You just saved 20k? Oh my god, did I actually? That's crazy. Okay. So what what about the puzzle SBC? We gotta get the Saudi League done. We've got the final team done as always. There we go. Of that. Got another pack out of that. League and we're gonna do Saudi League and MLS we're gonna do today. I don't know if I'm gonna do it for YouTube though. Sud and Lib we're gonna do again. Seria, I'll probably wait till Monday to do again. Um, young men with one day left. What a player he is, though. But freeze challenge. Here we go. Mega pack, too. Wow. Oh, Marquinhos does have a loan. I thought I kind of thought you guys were trolling. That's pretty cool. Okay, so four leagues. Players from one club, max three. Players from same nation, max three. Minimum four. Okay. 95 chem. This is kind of this is kind of an annoying one, isn't it? Our center back's up in price, boys, because of this. Damn, that's a crazy objective. Like, that's a crazy requirement, isn't it? I like it, though. I do. Yeah, center backs might be up in price. That's, that's good. Yeah, so apparently they also dropped Gary Henry. Bruno, I haven't even looked at, boys. I, I forgot about him completely. They kind of dropped him, like, in the middle of the night, didn't they? Wait, where is he? Did I miss him? Wait, is he out as an SBC? Are you sure? Oh, my God, there he is. Oh, that's such a cool dynamic image. Dude, he's probably worth one of your left test one of one of your left testicles. Apparently, yeah, people have multiple left testicles. Uh, my lord, have mercy. Nah, I won't be doing this. You can't craft it, man. That's a million coin untradeable. No, no. Maybe if this was out during team of the year, and either way, I needed somewhere to put all of my duplicate untradeables. Sure, I'd slowly craft this during team of the year because we'll be opening thousands of packs or hundreds of packs at least, most likely thousands. But 
No, I, I, I wouldn't. I'd, I'd rather wait for an icon. Not, I, not to say that this isn't an awesome card, but you can pretty much guarantee he's going to get himself a team of the season, right? 30 days? Oh yeah, he might actually be out during team of the year. Well, you know what? We'll see. We'll see. If there's nothing better, then maybe we will craft him because, I mean, he looks like an insane card. I loved his 87. And this is finally a worthy boost over his regular card. Yeah. Maybe. I got a day and 22 hours to do this, so No Man Left Behind will we'll continue to do these, especially with Futt Freeze. <laughs> we got today and tomorrow to do those, boys. Are you excited for that? Oh, baby. Hell yeah. I might do like five or so of the uh, player picks uh, to start off each epi too. Why not, right? Why not? We're making so much money. In fact, all of my loan players, or all of my um, invested in players. Should we see if they've gone up a bit here before we get into the packs? Let's just see. These puzzles might just make them get more and more expensive though, right? You got, you got to do one at a time, unfortunately. Wait, what? How do you list it? Oh. Eh. Are they or are they being price fixed? That looks like a price fix to me more so than prices going up. I'll try. Let's see. Yeah, it's a bit annoying though, isn't it? Having to uh to do one at a time. Doubling our coins real quick is not bad. I don't don't click L2, by the way, dudes. That that's what screws you in this situation. Do not click L2. Oh. They've dropped lightning rounds? I mean, of course they have, dude. How, how is anybody surprised by that? How, how are you guys surprised by that? Okay, so not much profits there. If any at all. We'll see. Serie A is 2300 a pop. Makes sense. Well, Serie A is always going to be expensive because of the Serie A SBC, right? I, I wouldn't have been able to, to get those bids in for cheap. Okay. Let's get these packs. Come on. Now I'm looking forward to uh, uh, the rare player picks. Here we go. Electrums. One rares, boys. Is the luck going to be in with a freaking one rare player pack? Let's see. Short answer, no. <laughs> RTTF Team 3 incoming? Wait, why? Is that spoilers? Are you, do you dare put spoilers in my channel? So again, something like this. Do we put up... Yeah, we put up here, right? And then we bring them back into the club after we use their duplicates. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Look at how many Electrums we have, boys. No in EA News? EA tweeted about it. Did they? Wow, that's kind of cool. Interesting. For, for cup competitions... There you go, UCL, League R. Oh, this is a tradable one too, nice. Uh, so in terms of dupes, I'm making the absolute maximum use of dupes, boys. Just for teams that qualified like last year? Oh. Leeds lineup? It's been out for two days, dude. Boards! Oh. Cheeky Vidal, I suppose? Nice. I'll take it. League on player. A couple of, couple of League on players in there. But we're definitely doing League on today. Okay, I guess if they're that much money, we should sell. It's like if they're discard, we we keep to, to reuse. All primes are in packs? Yep. Prime Beckham in packs? Yep. Uh, so League uh, will save for sure. Diallo, no real point. Oh my god, what? Bro, I sold Diallo like three days ago for 500 coins. Love it. This is where we make good chunks of money, man.
Maybe maybe not for Areola, but not all primes? Really? Hmm. Interesting. Prime Beckham into selling at two mil. Good. I, I mean, I'm glad the hype is there for him, man. It's kind of nice to see the community wanting someone that doesn't necessarily fit the meta. That's cool. I like it. To me, I see no negative in that at all. Oh, wow. Wait, is everything selling right now? Yo, the stocked center backs we, we might have to just cash out on, man. I don't know. Okay, does the rest have to be done on the web app? Damn. Oh, we got one. That sucks, though. Big chunk of these packs have got to be done on the web app now because of this stupid 30-pack limit. 90's going for 200k. Vidic is not primed. It's weird. Got one token already. Everyone's leaving before halftime. People are just burning through this, eh? Um, okay. Here we go. Look at those packs. So... We're, we're definitely over 150 packs for Project Team of the Year already. I know all of you guys probably look at this and think, oh my god, man, how does Nick not start opening these for Fut Freeze? Because Team of the Year. Team of the Year is my golden goose, boys. It really is. Wow. Wow, nice. Very hard to get a token when you're playing D1 Sweats. Yep. Should I check these prices too? Before we decide to put them back into the club. Uh, what the hell is going on here? I don't like leak. Uh, I, I would consider keeping. Because. We're good. 3,800? Are you out of your mind? What? Is it because of the mega pack? That has to be because of the mega pack. Oh my lord. He might have insta-sold too, honestly. People are crazy, dude. Yeah, we'll keep those. 3,800 on bid. I mean, that should sell, right? Crazy. Wow. EA brained it. Making guaranteed icons kind of dead. Yeah, I mean, I call... I, that's what I was saying earlier. No one really kind of picked up on what I was saying, but that, that is absolutely uh, my thought process as well. Okay, well, the good news is we got to go onto the web app to buy the players we need. So this works out perfectly. So again, to show you guys the, the NEP unassigned strategy, if you will. Uh, we're going to refresh it. Eto's price is 11 million. Dude, wait till his, his moments will just not be available ever. Just like uh, moments are nine. Bang. Bang. If I get Vidic now, do you think I have time to grind out the tokens? Uh, before Team of the Year is out? I believe so, yeah. I actually do think it'll work out. Can't well. Surprising no one's gone in for him. He's kind of fallen off, hasn't he? Since he was balling uh, in the Prem with Norwich. Now, this is the shit that is going to start irritating me the more time goes on. Is trying to find these one rares... Good lord. My eyes are bleeding, boys. Look at all the... Okay, we got some... Well, we'll open these two. Might as well. <clears throat> no man left behind Zendat. Bang. Okay, so where where was that pack? That pack was like here, right? Because I saw silvers. Love it. Love it. Look at that. Leak, I'm gonna get grinded again today, boys! League, I'm gonna get grinded again. Club stock paying off like crazy, dude. Like crazy. 
I'm glad you guys are starting to listen, man. It's not me that's saying it, too. Like, I I'm taking this advice from guys that know way more about market than I do. And I'm just, like, copying what they do. I mean, that's how you get better at stuff, right? You, you take the advice from guys that are experienced and you, you apply it to your own, your own grind. Dude, we are sitting on so much money that I just, I, I almost don't know what to do. Does that make sense? Like, I'm kind of lost. Lost as to what needs to be done next. Icon swaps and uh, League SBC grinding, I think, is going to be the uh, the motto here. Okay. Are the one rares done, though, buddies? I'm going to take you guys into... Oh, here. Nope, never mind. There you go. You got two right there. What What section? Okay, it's right near the line. What the hell? Oh, my God. I... You know what I thought that was going to be, right? I thought that was going to be a fuck freeze with those stupid freaking confetti things. Man, honestly, my viewer base would have lost their mind if I got a fuck freeze. <laughs> oh no, I got debated so hard. <laughs> Jesus! Oh. My heart. It's like a, a whitish flare. Oh, okay. I don't want to know that. I want to be, I want to be debated like that. Okay. Nice. Nice. Sudley grinded again today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at those Ligon players and Serie A players. Ooh, more Ligons. Ooh. What do we, I guess we go do that one Ligon team, right? Right now? Surely, instead of a no man left behind. Wait, we got two dupes though. I know this is league, huh? But why don't we do a rare player pick? Huh? Let's do one. Keikura and Nakamura, yeah? Keikura and Nakamura. Might be, might be worthwhile keeping, but whatever. First, no man left behind pack. First scream? Wait, what? I can't. What just happened? Where did it go? What the fucking hell? Hey, dude, where did it go? Did that just disappear into the abyss? I saw an inform. I didn't see who the hell it was, though. Let's try and open a bronze pack, I suppose. What? I. I didn't pick anything. Oh, you know what? I think it might have glitched out and it just gave me whatever the first option was, isn't it? Non-assigned? No, it won't be in there either, man. See? This is just all of our, our stuff. Or whatevs. Gotta clear this shit, too. Go home? Oh. Oh, okay, cool. Do we go Eber or do we go with an inform chat? I think we go inform, right? Might as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, got it. Damn, that's so weird. That is really weird. How that, like, just straight up disappeared on us. Okay, so we're going to go to squads. And then, once again, with a trade pile that's stacked... Quality. Can you not set like specifically search? I guess we'll just go special. DM. And then what was it? 40k, right? Oh my god. I almost I, you guys are right. I almost overpaid. Why the hell were only ones for 50k showing up? What's that about though? What the heck? He dropped again by another 20k? Oh, because of lightning rounds. I see. I see. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. What the fuck is in hell is going on, dude? I'm so confused. And then, dude, what?
What is this right now? Look at how many there are! Did I just get him for 38? Did I just snipe him for 38? W. That's a huge W. A hundred and thirty. Imagine it was a hundred and thirty-eight. Why would you say that, dude? That just freaked me out. Why'd you ever say that? All right, send to club. See what I mean, though, boys. You see how you can't do it in the in the. Um, in the in the regular console, but you could just do it here. Okay, again, it's a bit crap that you got to go all the way over here to buy your players, but it's a small price to pay to be able to be unassigned at all times. There you go. All right. Well, this dude's gone up probably doubled in price in minutes, which is kind of cool. Okay, this is really infuriating though. Damn it. Woo! 3,300 snipe. So there you go. There's going to be the Serie A squad that I'm planning to put together for today's grind. I like that. I like it a lot. Uh, I don't have OTW Tenali. I'm glad I don't. He's 35k now. Kappa? That's not a funny. Anyway. Um... Yeah, I'm glad I don't have OTW Tonali. Inform SMS over Tonali? Nah. Nah. Okay. Now, I've got... I don't think we've sold off the chem styles at all yet. So, let's give a dead eye to Correa. Because he's going to be our cam. Uh... We're going to give Leao a Marksman. I don't want to go too crazy on Leao. Finisher is actually Cell, so... Dead Eye, Artist, Rodriguez. I'm going to give a... I'm going to give a Guardian to, actually. Physical stats are already kind of nice. Give a Sentinel to Tanali. Um... These are untradeable. Should I just give a shadow? Why not, dude? Let's enjoy ourselves here. Who cares, right? And then Manalas can have a... I'll just go all in on Sentinel. I don't know if boosting his terrible dribbling would make any difference in any way. And then Mr. Sirigu. Do we not have gloves? Oh, I must have gotten rid of the gloves. Okay, so that's the layout for what... I, I don't know. You consider it a, a, a fun-ish team. And we're going to go all at attack with the 3-5-2, so it's uh, the secondary setup. The only change we're going to make here is that. Everything else stays the same. Romero, Manolas, Juan Jesus. Juan Jesus would do much better with a shadow, but such is life, man. It's okay. Either way. And that's what we're going to roll with. So should we go into a, a game or two just to see what it's like before we end off the epi here? Why not, right? I think YouTube's kind of looking, uh, in, enjoying these, these bits of gameplay. See what the experience is like, what type of team we're going to come up against, all of that stuff. So six wins with Serie A. Do I need to do anything else or focus on anything else? I don't think so, right? Nice, 16 ping is kind of good. Okay, what do we got? What team? Bundesliga. Oh my lord, what a cool team. Yo, I'm kind of looking forward to seeing people's full league teams. That's really sweet. All right, let's get destroyed. We've already lost once today. Let's tackle Tanali. Tackle. No pass, okay. Look about 
How's this guy's whole team moving like like in full unison? Do you guys see that? Nice tackle. Okay, what an AI wonder block that is. This guy's having a nightmare. I don't know what's going on. This is the worst FIFA I've seen in a while. Okay, I mean, I, I think I deserve a goal. <laughs> I'll, I'll just take that for what it is. I'm not going to lie, I might actually play this for just some fun. Uh, nice, Correa. Nice. Wasserman is cracked out of his mind, isn't he? Nice. Should have won that. Let's go. Is this guy spamming offside trap? Wait, is he constantly spamming offside traps? Holy God. He doesn't seem to be very good in the attack, but my God, is he like really effective? What is that? Did you guys see that? Like, anytime I have the ball in front of his 18, he's just spamming off side trap. I think. Hmm. Very interesting. Seems to be a very good defender. I don't think he's very good at attacking, but... This guy's got, like, all the craziness figured out in defense. Insane. Maybe I shouldn't have forced that pass, but... I got that! Just kidding. Just kidding. I got that though. That's offside. Nuts. Nuts. I think it's just a very high line. No, I don't know if I've ever... I've never seen someone... I mean, I've got a high line. I've got six and seven depth and stuff, and, and my line... My, my back line doesn't do that. Please, Correa. Offside, too. I can't even hit the target, but still offside. Well, technically, that was um, awful. It was awful, I agree. Cristiano Ronaldo. Crazy. Offside again. If I made that pass offside. To take advantage of that developing situation. It looks promising. Opportunity here. Wasserman AI controlled might be the most cracked player on earth. What? I, I've never seen I've never seen someone defend like this. It's so jarring. It, oh, that's a problem. Gonna slide it across. This is crazy. This is really fun, though. I'll, I'll admit, it's just endless back and forth. Nice tackle. I can't even get to the ball. No! What a terrible video game, dude. Are you serious? And and he's gonna counter and get a goal off of that. That's nuts. Get up, Siri. Go. Get in the. What are you doing, bro? I can't. Okay. All right. This is a friendly. I shouldn't let myself get angry. What did I just witness there? What the hell did I just witness there, man? That was the most moronic thing I've ever seen. Oh my god, I hate this game sometimes, man. The amount of benefit guys get that don't have delay is crazy. I've read that. What the fuck is going on? High pressing at its best. Dude has just pulled two defenders out of position. No worries. Now with Akimi. What can they do from here? Cristiano Ronaldo. It's there for Good goal, Cristiano. Good goal. Good goal. I just gotta focus up, man. This is friendlies. We're supposed to try and have some fun here. This guy's playing attacking football. I mean, he scored a ridiculously weird goal, but... Just trying to have some fun, man. Not that deep. Also, that's the patch. Maybe I take a touch there. Normally, before the patch, Ronaldo probably would have scored that. I'm actually not against the fact that Ronaldo missed that. Like, it's that's a bit of, of, of an obnoxious pass. What a play! Now, the fact Ronaldo missed that is nuts. That is ridiculous. Oh. 
Okay. <laughs> Just ignore Excellent Ronaldo. Defending. Yeah. Committed challenge. This is the weirdest FIFA player on earth. What is happening? I think he's on. I actually think he's on just high press because this whole team has zero stamina. What the f? His whole team has no stamina. Nice. Nice! Oh, does he overcommit with Klosterman and recover? Focus. Focus. This is madness. D mad. I don't know what I'm seeing. People quit a lot? I, okay. I don't know what experience you guys are having, but that's not what I'm having right now. This guy is the most insane defender I've ever seen. Oh, wow. There you go. Never mind. He does quit. Um, but that's uncanny. So what... What, what was that guy doing? Can someone explain to me how he was defending? Almost right on cue. I know, that's crazy. My bad. Ah, what, what, what was happening there? All right, we got our first win, I guess. Fair play. 10 depth? That doesn't explain any of what I just witnessed. It felt like he was on constant pressure, but while not being on constant pressure. That method works. High pressure offside traps. That was just nuts. Fair play. What a weird way to, to, to defend, but I kind of respect it. And good evening on what is a right. night for football. I love the teams, though, boys. I think no one is going to have anything to be upset about in these, other than gameplay being dumb at times. But the type of teams I'm facing, man, are just so fun. They're so original, dude. To be a thriller, Lee. Yeah, thanks, Derek. Both teams will no doubt be looking for a quick start. So important to get focus from the off. Really looking it's forward to this. Hopefully, it won't disappoint. Correa. What a tackle. Kyle Good Walker challenge. at center back? Is that what he's doing? Fair play. Well, this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. It deselected me. And he's away. Well, I'm struggling, boys. This is weird. My 3 5 2 setup is just getting shredded right now. Gabriel Jesus. Sam Maxima. Nice tackle. Nice ball. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Nick Pope gets the nod between the posts. Kyle Walker plays. Can he get them in front? Beautiful. They start as they lovely. <clears throat> lovely, lovely, lovely. Very nice. Very nice. Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, God. Ronaldo Silva. Jorginho Wijnaldum, and they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. Oh, he forces that. It's kickoff is so nuts. Nice tackle. And that is I, didn't that. I didn't do that. I didn't do that. I didn't do that. I do. Oh my lord. Rodriguez. No, that's not the pass. Sweet now Santa Correa. Maria, bro. My passes are so bad. Deolofeu. He continues his run. What the fucking hell? Take it away. <sighs> Major confusion. Especially when guys do passes like that. Nice tackle. That's a beautiful tackle from Rodriguez, man. Juan Jesus. Wow. Cristiano Ronaldo. Okay, Ronaldo just disconnected from the ball there. Weird. Correa! Oh, what a save, Nick Pope! Beautiful play, boys. Lovely. Nick Pope, man. Huge. It's a short corner. Can he finish? Oh! In terms of a finish, Matt, oh. Little <gasps> Rafael, what was that touch? Oh my god. I know he's a silver. Well, you look back at games some 
times and you say when was the new <laughs> What on earth? Oh my god. I don't know what was worth Leal's worse Leal's first touch there or that miss from uh, Hakimi. And return to Ronaldo. Wow, what a tackle. Oh my god. Fair enough. I thought I had him beat there. Oh. Let's go. Good tackle, just kidding. Oh my man. Oh. Oh. Nope. Mistakes everywhere. Still has the ball though. Ronaldo Silva. And return to Gabriel Jesus. Why do I feel like the first shot this guy has is gonna score? What a tackle, man! Alas, not out of bounds, dude. Oh my god. Well, no stopping him. Straight what? Thanks, man. I'm lost. He's away. No, it's too easy. It's too easy for these kids, man. If I'm not fully focused defensively, boys, 3-5-2 is just suicide, man. It really is. It's just you just get so much delay. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to. I don't know how to beat guys like this that are super aggressive defensively. Nice scoop turn. Just kidding, I guess. <laughs> Nice block, just kidding, I guess. Nice tackle, almost just kidding, I guess. Nice pass, totally just kidding there. Gameplay is a clusterfuck. I, I'll I'll be the first to admit it. I know I'm winning currently, but this gameplay is fucking AIDS. These kids seem to just bounce through tackles, make passes that make absolutely no sense, earn pens that make no sense. Awesome. Oh, and we're celebrating. Okay. Sure. Sure. Whatever, whatever helps you sleep at night, kid. This is fucked gameplay, though. I feel like you guys should be able to see it on the screen, right? Look at his Jesus. Rafael Leao. Well, potential danger. Of course, AI block. Why not? Nice pass. Of course, he plays it through me like my player doesn't exist, though. It's fine. Oh! Man, what on earth is happening? <sighs> yeah. This is just so AIDS. Such a bad game, man. This is ridiculous. Oh, I'm not quitting this game. I promise you guys that. I'll, I'll play all the way to the 90th. I, I could care less. I hate kids like this. A shit pen and a counterattack, and he's fucking custom celebrating everywhere. <laughs> I'm just playing golden goal. I'm not. I'm too petty to play like that. Hell no. I'm way too petty to play like that. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. This is like that champs game we lost today. Like it's, it, it's like his players have a goddamn force field around them. And no matter what moronic pass he makes, it comes off every time. Again, I'm sure it's all in my head. I'm sure I'm just irritated. So I, I'm sitting there. It just it feels like that. But like right there, Rodriguez read the play, lunged in for the tackle, like went. But look at these fucking pass. Mm, I'm fine. Everything's fine.
Lee, sum up his performance for us. Wow, it's simply the difference awesome. between these Sick two pass guys. to literally oh, nobody. Me. That's my fault, by the way. It's not the game's fault. My dumbass. <clears throat> Sam Maximan. Yep. Sam Maximan. An important interception. Committed challenge. Cristiano Ronaldo. On the offensive. What? Are you serious? I mean, I know it's a silver, but... How about that AI block? You got... Is it making sense now why I start getting irritated at the game? I'm sure, I mean, I'm sure it does. With anybody with half a brain cell, they'd understand why I get mad at this game. That's a tap-in, for God's sakes. I should have just shot with Ronaldo there. That's probably my fault, but oh my lord. There you go. Shove that one up your rectum, my guy. Want custom sellies? You got custom sellies. There you go. <clears throat> I'm all for it. This is the type of guy that would probably quit at a draw. Inside the final 30 minutes. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Correa. What in the fuck? That's just meant to be a ball roll. Oh, there is something crazy up with the gameplay today, boys. Yeah, let's keep it positive. Keep it positive. Keep it positive. Freaking friendly, man. I'm like going against. Oh my god. Nuts. Jorginho Wijnaldum. Well, possession tells you everything. Nothing really to split the two teams up. You have to say it's been an... See Ronaldo sitting down. there, like, turning in mud? Look at this! Playing some really expansive football. You just wonder what the coaches will be saying after this game. Who's going to win it? Do it. Can't do it. Have to. Correa. Have to do it. Rafael Leao. Dude, how does Leao make that bad of a pass? <laughs> Look at McDominay! He's got like 99 everything, man! He's literally murdering players! Come on, boys. Off the post. I just hit the post. That could have been the third, uh, the, the third free kick. Off the post, boys. This game hates me, man. And he's in on net now. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god. From off the post down the field to a tap in. Great game. <laughs> okay. I mean, what are you going to do, boys? What are you going to do? A single good goal has been scored. <clears throat> well, the lead barely lasted a few minutes, and they're Bro, that, that off free kick scored, off the post to a counter with Bernardo Silva was crazy, man. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. This is nuts. Inside the oh, this is friendly. This is this is crazier than most champs games I've played. Gotta give him some respect. This guy is a sweat. Like, like a decent enough FIFA player. He's using a pretty terrible team. How? What is happening, man? What is that? Focus. Focus. I have nowhere to play the ball. Go. Go. I've broken the press for God's sakes. Are you? I gotta delete the game. That like, how is that pass so fucked? How is that pass? Ooh. 
terrific defending to stop them progressing. Can he put them in front? Dude, what the hell? Korea just stood still instead of stepping into that. I've got a fucking migraine. Good. I think I deserve I, I think I deserve something out of this. I genuinely think I deserve something out of this. <laughs> Holy Jesus. I just want to go. I just want to go cry. What is happening? I, I wish I could tell you guys. I don't know. Gameplay has been nutty today. Like in the weirdest way possible. Well, they weren't so hard here to be in front, and that's been recognised by the supporters. They just need to hold on a bit longer to see this out. Of course. No one should be surprised by that. He's offside, bro. Oh my god. What in the hell is happening with this setup? Should we bring on Pandev to close out the game, boys? I think so. I think Pandev needs to come on. This seems worse than champs. Um, this particular opponent is extra toxic. You could tell by his celebrations. So I feel like maybe this guy stream sniped us or YouTube sniped us, I suppose. Just to like try and be extra weird about it tackle just kidding though how do you still have the ball good tackle again so delayed man so fucking delayed. he's gonna score he'll score no matter what i do here he'll score how is he even on side oh man last decision offside here all right gg boys i think we got this gg boys good stuff gg okay well i think that marks the end of the epi here uh it's been a long one another two hour grind i am really excited about the icon swaps don't let my confusion and stress take away from the fact that i'm still a very very big fan of this this is more my opponent and the dead gameplay causing frustration than the event itself i mean i'm sure you can tell by the by the score and the goals and 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 the way that guy played right anybody that isn't super oversensitive could have seen why i was getting frustrated in that game but we got the win right and i'm still enjoying myself and the nice part is if it got too toxic the best part about friendlies is you can just pause and quit right that that is truly one of the biggest advantages of putting all of these icon swaps within friendlies you're guaranteed to come up against someone else that's doing a, an objective guaranteed to come up against a one league team so you're not going to come up against just like the subbed on mbappes and neymars and stuff like that unless they're doing the league uh, grind which then why wouldn't they just start with neymar and mbappe so i like it i do like it a lot the gameplay is making my brain hurt but other than that it's been a good experience so i look forward to continuing continuing to do this on stream twitch.tv slash nick 20 if you guys wanted to jump in it's going to be a pretty late evening uh ethan's got soccer practice tonight but i'll probably be going till at least midnight uk minimum midnight to like maybe half past midnight uk so god bless you guys i appreciate you we'll be back tomorrow with more hopeful content from ea and uh as always we'll catch you beauties on the flip side peace